G Willikers, that game goes, that song goes on for like five minutes. No, that's the wrong source. Here's the right source, I think. Oh, wait, hang on. Oh, er, I hit the button. I hope that didn't do anything. Okay, we good? We good? Check. Checking. Test. Probably. Prop. Check. Maybe. <laughs> so, hey, how you doing? I'll be real with you, I, I have completely forgotten. I have completely forgotten what I was doing last time I played this. Also, I'm recording to my C drive now, my internal drive, so let's see if that helps any of the hiccups we've been having. Be sure to let me know if you see any. Of course, don't, don't feel bad if you miss them. Sometimes they're, they're very quick, very subtle.
It's not. Oh God. Okay, incoming scan data. Ah, uh, within Fendrana. Well, what is the quickest way there? Really? God, this song is sick! It's so good! Uh, wait, I was- I wanted the map open. Okay, so... There was a way... Gozo Ruins East. Is that where I want to go? God, I don't know. No, wait, it's- it's probably the- the door up- up here. Cause that's the one that's hard- NO! Don't go in- don't go in the ship! I don't want to save, I just got here. I didn't do anything yet. So, yeah, that one. No, not that one. Not up there. Where is it? It's over here. Okay, so the one, if I turn to the right. Up there. Oh yeah, and I had the ice beam. This this beam. Uh oh, don't fall down. Okay, so where is it? No way! No way! Yeah, no, I, I've already been there. That's that's like the normal entrance. I, I don't want the normal entrance. So I guess I do want the other way. I'm sorry, I'm lost in space. Oh, hang on. I'm gonna turn the volume up just a little bit. On my end, not on your end. I think it's fine on your end. But let me know if I'm wrong about that. Okay, so you just you just go this way and then it's like off to the left. Oh, I don't even know if I can get up there from here. That door might be Yeah, this is like the frigate crash site. I don't know, there's just there's a Chozo ruin area where I can like quick warp. Oh no, wait, there, this is a power up room. God, I I am getting so lost. Might be very slightly louder than usual. That's weird. Let me see. Uh... Oh, no, that was the wrong thing. Check. Checking. Uh, I'll dip it down to five. Might be, might be good. So, wait, where's the door here? I've, I've got to get to the door! Um... Yes, hello, I'm confused. Oh, oh, I see, I see. Well, I, I, I sort of see. Wait, is it, is it through here? Oh, wait, it's through, it's through here. I don't want to interact with you. I just, I gotta remember where the warp zone is. So I think this is my slowest, but most powerful beam. Okay, so it's like up, it's like up there, I think. Well, or maybe, maybe you go this way. I mean, I'm not gonna drown or anything. Metroid. Mm, what's that? 
Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, wait, I think I saw that before. I didn't know how to get that. I probably need the gravity suit. Yeah, the door, the door up there. How do I get that? And this is probably not even the right one. But I, I gotta refresh myself. Oops. Come on, can I can I get out of the water? I am I am under the water, please help me. Okay, is there any way for me to get like up there? Probably not without the uh, the boots. They're here, under the floorboards. <laughs> okay, well I give up on this. Let's try a different conduit. So let's see, it's not... Wait, where am I? So it's not here. And it's not here. And this is kind of off disconnected, so I guess I gotta go the... I gotta go the long way around. I don't know. Whatever. What, whatever. Whatever. With Samus and Ridley. Yeah, so I can just go the path I was going before. I have come to 13 minutes in and I have accomplished nothing. Well, some of that was the pre-stream, so... I mean, I guess that's vaguely fair. Eh. 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 Okay, so do the stones come back? They probably come back. Ow. Yep, they come back. Okay, so turn the right and become a scary monster man. Okay, load data. Samus looking around like she hasn't seen the same elevator 80 times in the past 30 minutes. No. I... There's really no reason that I should be dealing with you. I don't know why I am. Okay. That's probably like a grapple area or something. Right there. I haven't been there yet. Might need the the suit. Now let's see. Where's where's an E? So yeah, we want to go. Hey Miles, we want to go to the right here. We're gonna go through the right passage and head back over this way. Oh god, it's gonna take 300 hours. Ball skills.
I'm too fast for you. Okay, so I'm gonna check. It. Yeah, magma pool. I probably need the grapple beam there. So I turn. I turn left. I'm sorry. I I love these games, but I I do get very lost in them. And I, I'll try to speed this whole process up as much as I can. Okay, so just the door across from here. And then keep keep going in that general direction. M. Oh, probably for map. Oh, God. Can I just leave? <laughs> not, not dealing with the undead today. Am I still headed in the general? Nope. Nope. I got, I got turned, I got turned around. Yeah, so you've just bared witness to probably one of the more annoying things about Metroid Prime 1. Is that sometimes the Chozo ghosts will reappear. And half the time they're not worth dealing with. My monitor has gotten astray here. I'm sorry, I'm trying to I'm trying to fix it. Samus's arm is going all over the place as a result. Okay. It, my monitor got turned. I like it at a very precise angle. Yes. Space jump. Mm, sorry. Mm. Space jump, very useful. I have my monitors rotated to compensate for my weird tilted vision. Yeah, I mean, I got mine just kind of pseudo right next to each other and my main monitor the one i'm playing the game on was blocking my like the monitor i have the chat on and that would that would just never do that would <laughs> mm. Mm. i have some congestion-y type problems i think i'm trying to figure out where where the optimal Alignment is maybe there. I don't know. I'm still. I mean, as long as my entire face is on camera, I suppose it it doesn't matter where in the camera it is. But I'd be lying if I said it didn't bug me a little bit. Okay, we're getting there. We're getting there. I gotta climb. Gotta climb the super wall. Oop. Ah, the disappearing blocks. <sighs> I forgot, what do I wanna do with these idiots? I'm sorry. No, that's that's not working for me. The problem is I scoot around a lot. Okay, I gotta use a uh, normal beam. So, have I talked to you guys about the creation of this game on stream yet? I mean, I might have, but if it, it, it's a commonly covered topic, but I feel like I, I kind of want to touch on it if I haven't yet. Feel free to again. Well, mostly just like 
Retro Studios was, I think, founded by a dude named Jeffrey Spangenberg. And that dude was a nut. And, <laughs> like, Nintendo, you know, paid them some money to make some exclusive games for their platform. So they gave them, like, one, they gave them one GameCube dev kit. They were like, okay, make a game. And then Spangenberg was like, actually, I will make four game. <laughs> and, uh, uh, they did. Making four games with one GameCube dev kit, uh, it mm, tends to take a little while. <laughs> Not to mention half the time, Spangenberg didn't even show up for work. <laughs> okay, this is a shortcut back here. Ah! But he didn't even show up for work half the time. And, uh... Oh, it gets better. It gets better. So, not only were they making no progress on any of their games, but he was running, like, a porn site. Well, maybe not a porn site, but, like, a sexually suggestive website off of the retro servers, you know, that had pictures of women that he had taken. And <laughs> eventually, Nintendo got fed up with waiting for any sort of progress, so, like, Miyamoto himself flew down, and they were like, Jesus, what are, what in the name of God are y'all doing over here? And they saw that none of the games were making any progress, so, they said, okay, here's the deal. All, all of the games, except for one, are canceled. You know, you, you were going to make one game. So they saw a sci-fi prototype that Retro was working on, and Miyamoto was like, yo, uh, this is actually kind of sick. Uh, Y'all want to make a Metroid game? Uh, and they were like, uh, yeah, sure. So they did it. Uh, did, did. God, there's... I hate these things. Okay, one's down. Oh god. I'm starting I'm starting to remember why I like Prime 2 a little bit better. Let me see, is this Okay, so that moves me more to the left. So it matches. If I move the camera to the left, then I too move to the left. Most fascinating indeed. How, how do I get up there again? I'll go. How go up? How? Also, yeah, Nintendo was not happy about <laughs> about Spangenberg's. Uh, <laughs> a uh, horny site. <laughs> so yeah, they had him shut that down. <laughs> they were just like... <laughs> so they, they basically, they bought out his stake in the company. 
They were basically like, yeah, uh, we're gonna pay you 20 bucks to fuck off. <laughs> so, which one did I not have before? Did I have this? Because you know, there's one different thing for each each one. And I don't remember which ones I have. Or have done. It's like your parents finding out about the naughty sites you've been visiting. Yeah, basically. Except even worse. Like new grounds. <laughs> I mean, in fairness, Newgrounds did have some pretty wacky stuff, and by wacky, I mean kind of messed up. <laughs> like, uh, shoot the baby in the face or something. Oh, God. Oh, God. YouTube's gonna kill me now. I'll probably have to... <laughs> I'll probably have to take that audio out. Oh, well, well, we'll see what happens. We'll, we'll see what happens. Okay, so when I get the next beam, come back here. So, which way to Fendrana? Okay, these both, these both go to Talon Overworld. Neither of these go to Fendrana. So, up here. Dang it. Okay, I was worried there were gonna be ghosts in here. No, let me uh, free me from my prison. Okay, this this doesn't lead to nothing. Let's let's see what is what is south? I mean besides a direction. God, it's just I'm terrified that I'm gonna hear <laughs> It's like No Please I don't want to deal with you I mean either way I got an energy tank Which I've, as I've established I will take as many of those As the game is willing to give me Okay Yeah this is the this is the super zone. There's stuff down there I don't think I've gotten, have I? And I can't because I don't know how to go down there. Oh. Gas. The Life Grove Tunnel. Alright, so... I don't, I don't think I've explored much of anything over here. So it's probably worth taking a look in the adjacent rooms. <laughs> Pardon. Okay, go up the tree. Go up the tree. Okay, I don't need to go that much up the tree. Okay, so there's a door over like this way somewhere probably in there yeah there's like a alcove what was what was in here what what was in here can i do anything with this yet um hmm is this explodable ah uh, the ben the bendizium 
Oh yeah, I can't. I gotta go back to normal beam to use the super missile. Okay, yeah, I couldn't. I couldn't go through here because, I mean, realistically, I probably need the power bomb. Okay, it's it it's all coming back to me, and it's probably these are probably grapple points of some description. Hang on, hang on. Can I can I like can I boost off of these? Maybe that's a thing I can do later. I forgot. Yeah. Okay. I remember. I remember why I haven't been here. Time to load. If only there was like some way to get faster load times out of this thing. Like I could get, I could get a solid state drive for my Wii probably, but I'm not sure how much USB would bottleneck that. Probably a lot. I mean, granted, the load times weren't especially great on the disc either. Because they somehow, they somehow crammed all three Prime games into this thing. I don't know how. Like some kind of voodoo magic. Okay, let's try this way. Either way, I, I gotta get, I gotta get to Fendrana. They they called in John Burton. I'm not even convinced that's totally just him. You know, it's like I feel like if you coded for any of those old systems, you you either created the worst game in the world or you were a wizard. There, there was no in between. I should probably switch beams. Uh, okay, uh, so this, this is the, what this door leads to. Okay. Okay, so I have just wasted. A phenomenal amount of time. Okay, then. So, my best bet, I suppose, is probably to head to Magmore, then. Sadly, I, I feel like this kind of technical wizardry is becoming more and more of a lost art. I mean, not to say that devs aren't still talented, but I feel like the hardware gives you so much horsepower that there's a lot less incentive to, to come up with these things, if that makes sense. I mean, granted, in a, in a way, that's kind of a good thing, but still... Okay, so just head to the right, go to the, the root cave. Oh uh, yeah, yeah, just just head to the root cave. Let's all switch to Pico 8. Yeah, that's why that kind of thing is still interesting. Like, like you, you know, there's no real reason for it, but I, I like, I think people, I think some programmers just like to see, hey, what can I, what can I get out of these limits, even if there's really no reason to follow them. Yeah, most technical wizardry is good-looking games that also run well. Granted, that seems to be a lost art as well. Okay, so I need to go to the door that's like over this way. Ah, right, this, this. Which I can now get rid of. Okay, so here's the root cave. 
I I don't think I have what I need to get through there, so I just gotta go down. Can't check out that area yet. I uh, know. I don't wanna. What? Oh. The gas dimension. Not not everything's a dimension, Dustin. I mean, everything's in a dimension. This is the third dimension. But but not not everything is is an alternate reality. There there is beauty in in normal in normal life. You know, it doesn't have to be doesn't have to be some huge thing. Where's where's Fendrana? Ah. <laughs> Okay, so I can go this way to get to Fendrana. To the left. Okay, let me on through. I gotta go number two. Ah. <laughs> Spicy! Okay, so like over to the right here. Just, just not even bothering with your platforming challenge. Give me some juice, please. Hang on, wait, wait, wait. Can I get up there? I might be able to get up there. Uh, not, not quite. Oh, ugh. Hey, how, how dare you? You're being, you're being awfully rude right now. Yeah, so I need, I need some more juice to be able to get up there. I don't know what that juice is. But, no, wait, wait. Oh, wait, yeah, there's a grappler. A grappulation. No. No. Still gotta walk like 40 years. I am taking, I am taking some damage. So this way up to Fendrana, okay. So this place behind me. Got it. Oh, whoop. Whoops. Screw you guys. I'm going home. Okay. Okay, we're almost there. We are almost there. Progress might happen. <laughs> I don't know, but it's possible. Okay, now where does it where does it want me to be? Where in the name of God is that? How, how do I get there? Probably probably somewhere through here. Yeah, probably somewhere through here. So it's not that far back. It's not that far.
Can I can I get up? Oh, I can get up there. I can I can go this way. I don't think I've been this way before. Oh yeah, another fact about this game is Nintendo or maybe Miyamoto said like we are not going to we are not going to release this game unless you can make the transition between morph ball and regular Samus mode. And if you can't make it seamless, then we don't want it. So they they had a weird amount of pressure to do that. But I think they succeeded. Oh, no way, I know why I can't do this. Okay, we're in new territory now, so be ready for scans. Go in there. Go, go in there. Oh, this is this is like the way back up. Anything cool? Anything bodega? bodega? Uh, there, there's a door here. Ooh. This seems awfully sinister. Oh, wait, and it, it leads us here to the research core. Okay. Well, we, we've already we've already been there, so we don't need to go back there just yet. Let's go in this door. What's this way? Oh. Hey, hey feller. Oh, you're you're not being very nice at all. Same little twerps as always. Yep. Anything cool? I don't see anything. Ooh, this place. Oh, that that's new. Hey, I wasn't done with you yet. A Hunter Metroid, Adolescent Metroid, Energy Siphon Tentacle increases threat level. As Metroids develop, they become more efficient predators. An energy draining tentacle allows them to attack at a distance. Quick to anger, a hunter Metroid will charge troublesome prey and attempt to ram them into submission. Cold base attacks are still quite effective against these creatures. Okay, duly noted. All right, no probalo. Yeah, so there's there's stuff. There's stuff down here. There's a missile underneath the ice, but I have no means with which to crack it. Yeah, that is a good trope. Okay, this is where I came from. Are there any icicles to knock down? Hmm. Well, I can't get over there. Can I get up there? Maybe I can get up there. Seems vaguely possible. But also just vaguely not possible. I don't know. Oh wait, wait. Ugh. <laughs> I would I would like to enter the zone, please. So there's only there's only two ways out. And it's it's one of these two doors. Ah, uh, okay, okay.
Ooh, the tube. Okay, yeah, I, I know, I know. Give me a sec. I'll play with you. Yeah, I know about the gravity pulses. Yeah, I know. I'm working on it. I'm working on it. I'm headed that way. God, don't worry, Mom. I'm going to pick up groceries. Okay, so this is very grapply. So let's try heading down. Oh, water. Oh, that thing. I forgot how to deal with you. Was it energy? I, I forgot, I forgot what you want from me. I don't know. Oh, that is what it wanted. Now, where's a, there's a door like over this way. Those things are terrifying, even if they're very, very weak. Okay. The water tube. Ow. Oh, let me on through. Doo doo doo. Oh, there's another doo 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 doo. Am I not hitting it in the right position? All right. Can I get up there? Probably not. Okay. No! How dare you! Hold on one sec. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> I swear, I, whenever I'm playing video games on the internet, my body's like, all right guys, he's gonna need all the snot he can get. <laughs> he's not gonna be able to get through it. If we don't, if we don't up our game. Okay, so just any any purple door that I have not already been through. Can't knock that down. Oh wait, wait, wait! I see, I see the way. No, don't, don't, don't reference that old me. Don't that I wasn't. You don't either. Anyone who does, ban from the chat. How do I get out? How do I get out of here? Get me out. I don't want to be trapped in water world anymore. I would much rather be trapped in Virtual Boy Wario Land. Have I scanned the- yeah.
Where's okay? Where is the door? Okay, it's right here. Is that, is that a thing? No, that's a frozen fish. Okay, this no that I, I thought that was a, a cove an alcove I could go through it wasn't All right, there's some spookies down here Definitely some spookies Okay, I remember what happens here. Good things are going to happen in the near-ish future. And there it is. There is said good thing. Finally! Finally! I am become God! It's Poseidon, specifically. Do it! Do it! Do it! Yes, purple! I love being purple! They should, they should just say Biology Gallery. What does that mean? Prob it's probably in the, uh, the main, like, Prime Trilogy menu. I already scanned these, right? Yeah, so they should really just say being underwater doesn't suck anymore. <laughs> because that's, that's about the, the long and short of it. I forgot how you kill these things. Oh, missile seems to do the trick. Anyway, now that being underwater is no longer stinky poo poo. Ah. A very lovely place. A very lovely face. I missed it. What was the water fixing upgrade? Uh, gravity suit. Ah! Drone! Okay. So now we can explore the frigate if we want to. Oh. Yeah, it, it's the slowest, but if you hit them one time, they're basically dead. So it's very good for up-close enemies. Okay, so to the right here, there's a door I haven't been in. Oh, and I chose a good time to go in it. Hmm? Hmm? Eh? Oh. What? I... I beg your... I beg your pardon? I was... I wasn't moving Samus there. Like the... <laughs> that was weird. Like it produces some kind of, uh, some kind of flow. Okay, so let's see here. Ooh, this is, uh, no wait, I've been here. This is the, the frozen pike. Whatever that means. Yeah, so next next place to go is probably the frigate. 
the friggin' frigate. Laugh, please. Oh, that was a very spooky noise. But it was just, it was just these idiots. The least menacing men on the face of the planet. Well, that, that might not be true. There might, there might be a few less menacing. But not many. So, is there any way... I mean, I probably... The quickest way is probably through Magmore. Yeah, these both, these both lead to Magmore. So yeah, going up to the top here is probably my best bet for getting back. Is it through here? No, it's it's the very top. Very top. Wait, was this not oh, this isn't the morph ball part. This is the morph ball part. Yeah, I appreciate they added in the uh, Prime 3 jump, even if by accident. Because <laughs> it, it saves us a little bit of time. Maybe not a lot. But at least some. Yeah, I gotta. I can't do anything about that right now. I think I know what I gotta do to get that, and I don't have it. All right. So, so just to make sure. Yeah, yeah. No, none of them. None of them led it to led led it. Yeah. Uh, no, diesel, please. None of them led to Talon Overworld, so I gotta take the long way around. Now, which, which is the best way to do- well, there's a save station right behind me. I better use that. I better take- I- why am I so itchy? Why am I so bitchy about being itchy? I'll stream it on Twitchy. No, I don't- I, I don't have pet names for a streaming website. That's weird. Just tank it. Like, I appreciate... I appreciate these, uh... Wait, what's over here? I haven't been, I haven't been in the workstation. T can I even get to the workstation tunnel? Yeah, I think I can. I think I can do it. Yeah, I can do it. Let's see what's in the workstation tunnel. Might be something cool. Oh, wait. I remember. I remember now. Isn't it funny how all that works out? So, yeah, I got a, I got a bit of a way to walk. Oh, ow. I'm just, I'm not even pretending to deal with y'all. When y'all have something worthwhile to give me, maybe I will fight you. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, spoilers, I, I basically need the power bomb for that stuff, I think. And I, I, I ain't got, I don't think. Yeah, don't, do not got. Yeah, so just just keep walking this way. You won't you won't miss it. <laughs> nah, nah. Like they want you to swing. I'm just I'm just tanking the hit. 
I'm just taking the damage because it's quicker than not. God, can I boost on these? These are slow. Just fall. Just make me fall. Make me fall, I'm the battle ball. Make me fall, you're the piano man. Okay. Oh god. I got itchy nose disease. Okay, so just just walk over there. Whatever. I can deal with it. Is it is it dangerous to go down here? No. In fact, it's it is quite it is quite beneficial. Well, maybe not that beneficial, but a non-zero amount. No. No. No, why would I? Why would I even? I mean, I will say that uh, that's one thing Castlevania does better than Metroid. Is Castlevania, you have a reason to keep fighting these enemies. Metroid, if you can get by them and you don't need, like, health pickups, you're usually fine. <laughs> you're usually fine just skipping them. Also, hey, Dr. Mad, what's up? You don't actually have to answer that if you don't want to. Now, where's... Where's the Friggle? Oh, okay, it's it's over here. It's over here. It's, it's back in the start area. Hmm, no. No. The gall to ask me what is up. Yeah. That's about the long and short of it. I mean, you know what's up with me. I'm it's right it's right here. It's right there. Are you artifact hunting? No, not yet. We're not that far in the game yet. Because I keep getting I keep getting lost in Prime World. No, I'm I, like again. Uh, yeah, okay. Uh, this way? It, no. <laughs> Back up. Backing up. There we go. Here, here it is. It's over here. Is there anything under here? Uh, no, there's an invisible wall there. Which is not something this game does a lot, I feel like. Work's been keeping you too tired. Oh, I'm sorry. At least you can make some of that coin, though. You, you know, a little, little coin. Okay. I, I do not, I do not make much coin. And this is, this is something I am not proud of. Wait, okay, I gotta go through here. Okay, into the crash. Into the crash site. So we were here before, but there wasn't much we could do because water. But now I have water implements. And thus, there is things we can do. Let's 
So, about here. Yeah. Okay, so there was a big old, there's a big fat door down there. Oh, you bought a Zerg figure? <laughs> nice, nice. No, that's all right. It's, it's not like, it's not like I'm one of those 2,000 viewer chats where the, you know, everything's scrolling by. What was in here? Oh, it's a save point. Yeah, I'll save. I, I wish they made a Toy Story 2 randomizer. I mean, the game, not the movie. <laughs> I mean, a movie randomizer would be interesting. I'm not sure how that would be pulled off. Okay, so this is roughly the way where we couldn't do anything before. Oh, oh, brr. Okay, thank you, game. What the? Oh, 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 there's a tentacle. The YouTube poop generator. That is true. <laughs> PC game, the movies was all about that. That's true. Oh. Drowned space pirate. Poor dude. Or, or maybe he was dead when it crash landed, I don't know. Is this a door? I don't think that's a door. What? What's going on here? Where am I? Okay, there's a door in like this, in this direction. Uh, is it unpowered? This, this door has no power. Okay, so power must be restored somehow. And there's a thing all the way down there. Great. <laughs> you need to read Harry Potter. Yeah, uh, you're talking to Dr. Mad. Yeah, that, that's very good. Okay. So I need to find the others. Okay, here's another one. Sorry, the sensor bar kind of freaks out sometimes. Okay, I already hit that one. Oh, oh, okay, please. Oh, there's one up here. That didn't quite work out. Okay, there we go. Now door is powered. Do you not have lock on na aiming enabled? No, I do. I can lock on to stuff. Unless you mean like where it auto points. But I also like having the ability to do this. Ah, uh, please. Your cursor keeps moving when locked on. Yeah, but I like to be able to do this. I think that's that's good. Okay, go down. Oh, what what's going on? Aqua drone.
God. Please, please become deceased. Ow. Is the crash ship meant to be friggin' Orpheon? Uh, yes. This is the intro area of the game, but flooded. Oh, okay. I, I see what's going on here. Yeah, there are a lot of reasons you don't want to play X7. Anything? Okay, shoot. Shoot target. It's a little tedious, but what can you do? Oh, Aqua Pirate! Aqua Pirate! I didn't think that was their actual name. Haha, <laughs> when you freeze them, the heat signature goes away. That's neat. <laughs> I love how in the Metroid universe you need a gun to open doors. Yeah, it's a little weird. But, I mean, I guess, video game. I mean, who knows, maybe you can just touch it, and this is just Samus' preferred way. I don't know. Space doors. Oh wait, have I? Is, is this? No, I haven't been this way yet. Aqua Reaper. Oh. Rip. Oh, what's that? Aqua sack. Okay, what what is down? A door. <laughs> the poor pirates get it rough in the Prime games. Yep. But they also kinda deserve it. So, there might be something up here. Okay, I, I think I got the rhythm for this. Nope, I messed it up. Okay, a little too late. Like I said, the more of those you want to give me, the more I'll, I'll take them all. Very blue. Yeah, I already, I've seen y'all before. Many times, in fact. There's a door here somewhere, ice door. Man, I can't wait for October. Yeah. Gonna be a good time in history. 
I mean, not even for just Dread. I mean, mostly for Dread. But <laughs> you also got Mario, Par like I think Mario Party and Monkey Ball. Is WarioWare coming out then too? Might be. Metroid OLED. Ooh. Intense radiation detected. Oh, I think we're entering a very serious part of the game. Super Mario Party. No, you mean, uh, you mean Superstars. Super Mario Party is the one that's already out. Ah, uh, the phase on mines. This is a part of the game that exists. I will say that much onto you. Anything behind here? Probably not. Ugh. Ugh. No, I don't like this place. Yeah, I wish I knew more people IRL that wanted to play these games, but I don't really. Alright, so this this is gonna be this is gonna be tough potentially. Ooh, that was a splody. That was a splody. Okay, we got to disable. Oh, hey, mate, what's going on? Y'all, nah, y'all are the same old pirates I've been dealing with. Okay, now you are deceased. Anything up here that's cool? I enjoy the implication that you have just made that a space pirate would be named Craig. Okay, now what's going on here? Okay, there's there's more up. Okay. Uh there's a a little track. Every species has a crate. Okay, so I gotta go down here, yeah. Anything cool about this? Okay, so let me try soups. Nope, can't get in that. Transfer of building materials complete. Processing of materials for Xenome containment units underway.
report all Phazon mutations to Science Team immediately. All units with useful mutations will receive an increase in pay and rations. Elite and Trooper candidates are now being selected by command. Crane controls are functional but require power. Okay, so this wasn't it. Not it, Chief. Okay, that leads to nothing at the moment. But, it could lead to something. Ah, uh, okay. Okay, there we go. Go figure. Now hang on, let me log on this computer and go to, uh... Let me go to that Beach Babe site I've been told about. Whatever he called it. Okay, this is for a, this is for a missile. Okay, that's that's pretty cool, but <laughs> how do I get in? How do I get into the mine? How do I get into the Phazon mine? Once was a coal pit, now it's a Phazon ride. Oh, that would probably be it right there. Okay, but I think there might be a, a save station. I think this might be to save. So I kind of want to do that before I go in here. Because it, it's very possible that I could die. Nice aquarium in your radioactive mine. Produce the three-eyed fish from the Simpsons. Okay, I thought maybe that was a way I could go or something. No. Alright. What is this thing? I don't know, the game doesn't seem to know either. Well, here we go. This, this could be a thing. I remember this being very much a thing. Okay, same old pirate.
Okay, here we go. I probably should go in that door back there. I need to scan you. Wave Trooper. Space Pirate armed with Wave Beam technology. Space Pirates have reverse engineered several of your weapons, including the Wave Beam. A flaw in the design makes these pirates vulnerable to their own beam weapon system. These weapons are inferior to your Chozo design originals, but still quite potent. Okay, so basically, use the wave beam to kill the wave beam. Bro, yeah, these guys. These guys are what make this area a thing. Oh dear. Okay, he's dead. So let me go back in that door down there. Alright, I might not be able to. There's like a force field here. Okay, force field access prohibited. Okay. Also, there's a red do Wait. No, the, the purple door's up here. Right, okay. Sorry. Got mildly turned around. Okay, Bendesium, was that... That was like the power bomb thing, I think. But I'm gonna try that anyway, yeah. Okay. Whoop! That, that always feels weird. <laughs> there's, there's no point where that feels normal. Oh, my Geiger counter's going off. Yeah, so this is basically a big old combat section. Which is why I remember it being a thing. Like, there's a lot of exploration. There's a lot of combat. In this area. Like, the rest of the game, exploration. This... This is get ready to fight. I like that they, before they notice Samus, they just kind of are casually walking around the computers. That's a nice detail. Ooh. Elite Pirate Alpha. Mendesium Alloy. Recommended battle systems for Elite Pirates are as follows. Shoulder-mounted plasma ar artillery cannon, repulsion shield, wave quake projector, energy siphon system, and retractable wrist bayonets. Sick. Initial Project Helix. Experiments with space pirate embryos were disastrous. The phajon infusion process degenerated brain tissue even as it augmented, augmented muscle mass. None of what we have termed elite pirates lived to maturity. The few that survived their infanthood suffered severe psychotic breakdowns as juveniles killing anything within their zone of perception. Research team Sclera made a recent breakthrough in which parasite studies with a phase on strain codenamed Vertigo were highly successful. Since then we have successfully fused Vertigo phase on with space pirate DNA with great success. The latest batch of elite pirates have reached maturity successfully and are ready for field testing and training. So we're we got some genetic I mean, we already knew that. But it's still going on. Oh, platform system active. 
Good, good. I want that active. Anything else cool? Doesn't look like it. Uh-oh. Okay, I had, n <laughs> I had like no cover there. I probably should have seeked out cover, but what do you know? That didn't happen. <laughs> Ah, here we go. Bioform Samus Aaron has made planet fall on Talon 4. The hunter is among us. All units are hereby ordered to attack Aaron on sight. Terminal force is authorized. Report all sightings of Aaron to security command at once. <laughs> Alright, so... These are fairly recent. Oh crap, yellow. Recording to logbook. Oh god, oh crap. Hang on, I'll be I'll be right with you. Oh dear. Yeah, he had a special delivery for me. Pulse beam mining configuration. So, we back in the mine. Attention all units, report to your battle stations. Failure to comply with this order is an act of treason. Treason is punishable by termination. Alright, so. Ro rotate, rotate cannon. Get out of cannon. And then scan. Yeah, there we go. But we probably want to do that with the others. Just in case there's cool and or sick things here. Could be either. Oh, I didn't scan that one. Doesn't really matter, but I didn't scan it. I don't know if that's pointed at it yet. Ah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I think we're good. I think we got them all. Can you aim the cannon at yourself? You know? Maybe. So, it, it seems like there's only one with any actual stuff in it. So, hold on. Gotta go, gotta go all the way around. Uh, 
Uh, mm, that's a little bit to the left, but it still roughly me. Oh no, it shoots above my head. Okay, we're all right. If it worked and that was instant death, I would have been so mad. Okay. Oh, ow! The, the pylon! The power generator! Alright. What kind of pirate? Okay, more yellow. Uh, I don't got no cover. Okay. Take whatever energy I can get. Represents the central pillar. Let us, let us put tracks on our pillar, that that Samus Aaron can go up. It's brilliant. Craig is a genius. It requires power to operate. So what's what's the deal here? I can't I can't tell that I see a red line, but I don't think it's the red line I actually want. So let's let's get that there. Warning? What 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 are we warning me about? Is there phase on? Is that it? Okay, so I'm trying to I'm trying to parse this. Okay, so I think I want to go back down. and move this over here. So it was the, the red one. So, oh wait, I see yellow, where's red? Oh, here it is. There's nothing there! <laughs> Okay, then. Try that again. Okay, I'm gonna go up the blue one. It's a puzzle. It's a puzzle that must be solved with your cranium. Okay, so yellow is the tallest. Okay, blue blue's the shortest, red is the second shortest, and yellow is the tallest. Okay, so red does lead to something there. That's why the camera points up. So that you can see that. So I need to attach the two. Gotta play the wire game. You know that? You know that game? 
I know that game. The game. Oh no, I lost the game. Not again. Okay, perp, perp, purple troop. I mean, I can take care of these guys, I think. Yeah, these these are destroyable. Just gotta shoot them a couple times. But now I can't help but feel like the top path back here might be uh, upgrade. Then again, I don't see. Yeah, I don't see a terminal for that. Wait, wait. Mmm, Bendesium. My greatest foe, Bendesium. Where am I? Okay. Phase on mines level two. Here we go. Pain. Pa Ooh. 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 Time for the to go all aboard the pain train. Mm, my my health reserves are dipping a bit. Thank you for helping to replenish them. Okay, I feel like there's some stuff about to happen here. Oh, he's awake. Phazon Enhanced Space Pirate. Incredibly strong, armored, and well-armed. Absorbed beam weapon shots. Has extreme thermal signature due to lack of shielding. I'm in I'm in danger. Security Command issued an all-points alert after the fall of Zebus. The alert concerns Bioform Samus Aran, also known as the Hunter. Subject is a female hominid and is heavily armed and extremely dangerous. Subject uses a powered armor suit of unknown design in battle, along with a number of potent beam and concussive weapons. All combat units are structured are instructed to terminate Aran on site, preferably in a fashion that will allow salvage of her powered armor suit and weapon. Oh. A considerable bounty will go to the unit who delivers air into command. Dead or alive, it matters not. Investigations into a possible ingress point for the impact crater continue to meet with failure. The shield of strange energy that protects it is per in impermeable. 
and all attempts to tunnel past it have proven fruitless. Our continued futility in this matter is made all the more significant in light of the recent lifeform readings we've discovered emanating from deep within the crater. Analysis of the readings indicates that a mass of creature is gestating there, absorbing enormous amounts of phazon from the phazon core at the heart of the impact crater. That this discovery makes accessing the crater doubly important. Not only will it open the door to vast deposits of phazon within, but it will also lead us to this creature, whatever it may be. Ow. Oh dear. Oh dear me. Okay, this guy's not quite as bad as he looks, but... So, he, he basically absorbs my attacks some of the times. Okay, so I think that keeps him from being damaged by missiles, too. Okay, I think we got him. Wasn't that bad. Was not, was not that bad. Phazon Nutrient Vat Elite Pirate ra Ration Processing in Progress. Okay, so there's a door. Yeah. Something was shooting at me. I think it's Ice Pirates. Okay, it says the same thing. How do I get up there? Oh, okay, I gotta go this way. Oh, well, they'll come to me. Don't worry. I can't deal with both of y'all at the same time. I'm sorry. It's more, it's more than I can stomach. Okay, so let's see. Some more lore. Don't, don't drink the phase on, or we're gonna take your food away. Hang on one sec, sorry. Bioform Samus Aaron continues to assault our holdings on Talon 4. Security has been compromised in multiple areas. Casualty rates are rising. Command has authorized a sizable bounty for the capture or termination of Aaron. Report to your field officers for details. Science team is attempting to reverse engineer Samus Aaron's arsenal based off of data acquired from her assaults on our forces. Progress is slow but steady. Command would dearly enjoy turning Aaron's weapons against her. We believe we can implement beam weapon prototypes in three cycles. Aaron's power suit technology remains a mystery, especially the curious morph ball function. All attempts at duplicating it have ended in disaster. Four test stu subjects were horribly broken and twisted when they engaged our morph ball prototypes. Science team wisely decided to move on afterwards.
Yep, that that one's particularly famous. Evaluation of plasma artillery cannons is complete. The weapons are fully functional, but a flaw has been discovered. Subpar thermal shielding gives them a high heat signature. This could make them easier to target for enemies with enhanced vision capabilities. Security alert. Computer systems compromised. Bioform Samus Aaron has cracked our systems. The hunter can access our system at will and is able to bypass most of our security programs. Use manual locking systems when possible. Facility commands request for elite pilot... Elite pi Why can't I read? Why am I so bad at reading? Elite pirate transfer to security forces granted. Prepare units uh, blah, 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 and blah, 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 for field duty at once. Metroid aggression levels are rising. Be alert for any attempts by Metroid to escape from their quarantine areas. Their energy absorption ability is not able to disrupt our force fields, but continued exposure to Phazon may change things for the, for the worse. Reports on hunter activity are in. Analysis indicated that the Morph Ball technology to inf is using the Morph Ball technology to infiltrate our facilities. Recalibrate sensors to search for Morph Ball energy signatures. Got Reading ability diminishing. Results are in from a field are in from field studies on the Bioform group Chozo, who we believe are extinct. We believe that Talon 4 was once a stronghold in a great Chozo Empire, brought low by the meteor strike. Planetary devastation brought an end to the Chozo, yet remnants of their society remain. We are studying these relics in an attempt to harness their power. What is of no use to us, we destroy. In time, we shall have all we need from this dead race and shall wipe the planet clean of their ugly ruins. The dead should serve the living, not hinder them. Although we are no closer to finding the artifacts of the Chozo, we have at least produced a viable hypothesis for their function. It appears that each of the artifacts corresponds to one of the statues on the temple platform, and that each one acts as a small key to a huge lock. Judging by the number of statues, we assume there must be 12 artifacts. Once we find the resting spots of all 12, we can bring them here, unite them with their statues, and open the gate systems at long last. Once we do, the impact crater, and whatever creature it shelters, will be ours for the taking. Phazon infused fungal harvesting continues. Replacement of de deca tri tritical with phazon infused fungal matter in elite ration mix has been authorized. Security requests deployment of elite pirates in Metroid quarantine areas. The high casualty suffered by standard pirate units deployed in Metroid areas is not acceptable. Reconfiguration of security drones authorized. Deploy new drones to mission critical areas immediately. Force field offline, access granted. We have come to another dead end. It is clear now that we will never discover the locations of the Chozo's artifacts until we can decipher the messages carved into the statues in this abominable temple. Our, our language databases are woefully inadequate, and our linguistic analysts can come up with little more than vague theories. The best hypothesis that we can offer is that finding artifacts will require items spiritually linked to Chozo civilization. However, without these items, we are lost, and command grows more impatient by the day. Results must be produced soon. Oh, but we ain't done yet. We got more to read. Replacement of standard hatch covers continues. Steel covers will be replaced with cordite and bendesium covers in two deca cycles. Planetary stealth technology is back online. We have evaded detection by the battle cruiser Emons. The brief lapse in planetary security caused by the crash of our frigate is over. Now we can concentrate our efforts on the hunter. Increase phase on portion of elite pirate ration by 18%. You think they're getting enough? Report any signs of ration rejection by elites at once. Analysis continues on these cursed ruins in the Chozo temple that hovers near them. We are now completely certain that the containment field denying us access to the impact crater is linked to the strange artifacts that belong in the temple. 
but we are no closer to finding them or deciphering the riddles that seem to cover every wall of this ruined place. Command grows increasingly anxious for a resolution to this matter, so we must redouble our efforts. X-ray squadrons will begin terrain sweeps within days. Until they begin, patrols are instructed to report any and all architectural anomalies to their commanders. <laughs> Translation of some of these. Yeah, that's about right. There have been numerous incidents involving spectral entities at Chozo Ruin sites. Several personnel have been assaulted by these Chozo ghosts. Few have survived. Survivors speak of swift attacks from nowhere, brief sightings of the enemy, then nothing, only to be followed by another attack. Science team believes these attacks are in response to our efforts to recover Chozo relics and artifacts. Somehow, these entities are able to interact with the physical world, and it appears they wish to keep their artifacts to themselves. We will make them pay for such arrogance, for even ghosts can be destroyed. I gotta say, the sp space pirates are kind of badass in this. Even if they don't stand up to me. Because I am more badass than even they. Oh. Oh, the upgrade noise. I hear it. Gas. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, stinky! Phazon doesn't work, add more Phazon. I'm taking any advantage I can get here. Oh. Okay, there we go. Okay, Elite Pirate. Bendesium. Again. So this is the way back up, I think. Oh, there's one over there. Oh. Come on, come on! Die! Yes, thank you. What is this? This was nothing. Okay, force field deactivated. I'm almost certain I'm gonna get rammed up the butt by an elite pirate.
Our enemies will tremble before the might of our elite forces. Auth unauthorized Metroid feeding is strictly prohibited. Death to the hunter. Death to all who oppose us! Test results, test results from battle simulation Samus Aran are promising. Elite units report a 74% success ratio against Aran in testing. High Command is pleased, but expects a higher ratio by Project's end. Increase bomb boot patrols in unauthorized areas. Scramble all aerial units immediately. Flight pattern Sigma-4 is in effect. Elite Pirate Upsilon's pro propensity for Phazon has enabled our research team to infuse it far beyond our safety restrictions and the results have been extremely encouraging. Its constant phase on diet has increased its mass exponentially, but it has retained all mental faculties and shows dexterity with all elite weaponry, including plasma incendiary launchers and the chameleon manta issued for cloaking purposes. Elite Pirate Upsilon exhibits miraculous healing abilities. When injured, it seeks out phase on deposits and coats itself in the substance, which instantly mends the creature's wounds. The subject, which we are codenaming Omega Pirate, based on these developments, shows the potential to be a new standard for our armies. Our only concern at this point is its potential over-dependence on Phazon. Okay, I'm getting out of here. Oh, going down. Whoop, oh. Whoop. Can I get a save room? Uh-oh. There's one missing here, I think. Incoming scan data. Power surges. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm right there. I'm right there. Uh -oh. <sighs> and I still haven't gotten a save point. Let me guess, Bendesium? Oh my god. Yep, I'm gonna have to. Oh. I probably need the ice beam. Oh god. I'm in trouble. I might have to look up a guide for this because I really don't want to die. <laughs> Not after all that. Let me see, the cloaked drone.
Okay. So I need the wave beam, I believe. Okay, there we go. Okay. And this door is uh, locked. Because of course it is. The keeping of pets has been suspended until further notice. Domestic beasts have been deemed highly susceptible to phase on madness and thereby and thereby a hazard to personnel. All gronkats and old baps must be disposed of immediately. Failure to comply will result in the loss of pay for a cycle and reduced rations. An entire shift of dynamo workers have been trans transferred following bouts of phase on madness. U units have reported to science team for use in laboratory studies and the new elite pirate program. Their dementia will make them adequate training adversaries for the elite team. <laughs> Jeez. Ah, uh, power bomb. Well, I mean, I would like that. Can I not like? Can I not like go through there? Oh dear. Up. Oh, okay, we're going through the electro maze. What is this? Oh, okay. Okay, just, just inch it through. Oh dear, oh, okay, okay. Okay, goodbye, power. Power device. Okay, thanks. Thanks for getting me out of there. Yep, yep. Okay, now please, please give me the save. Oh, it's beautiful. It's a beautiful thing. Okay, I'm going to stop there because I've been going for two hours. That, and I think this would be a good place to stop because then next time we'll know exactly what we're doing. It'll be right there. So thank you for tuning in. I'll see you guys later.